That's a better one. Some of them, some of them feel big and come up small. Oh, stick. Some, some feel small, come up big. So definitely was a good school back there. I don't know whether to do another drift or we'll just go a little bit further down and work out. I think I just grabbed the bottom. This one. Now this, this is. Oh, what is it? Look at it lunging. This is where this little abu. I feel. It, see that lunges. This real so forgiving. It's only a small fish, but I, I don't want to lose on those hooks. So, ah, oh, as I say it. I don't care, I still hate losing fish. <laughs> you just feel it lunging? I was... Nah, I don't know what it was to tell you the truth. I think it was just a small brim. I just think I just had him skin flicked. Looks are getting pretty straightened out. <laughs> Doing the same, that's just lunging. It's not a big fish, I've just got the drag so light because after losing that last one. Yeah, I'll lose it again. Yeah. Oh, it's more, it's those lunges, you know that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, the hooks These hooks are so tiny. Once you've caught, like I've caught a few fish already with it, so the hooks are a little bit bent out of place. I'll be spewing if it just comes up a... It's got some weight in it, whatever it is. Too big flathead. That's what I first thought it was, just a little flathead, but it's probably a, just a brim coming up sideways on me. Oh, don't worry about the net. Yeah, he's a nice little brim. I think it was back in that drag off, the, like just playing it with no drag. That's see, see the lunges. Yeah. Push after that other one. You get your line out because that school probably follows. Now he's woken up. Yeah. Oh, this is a perfect flats rig. This the, the little Abu reel's got the most sensitive drag, and then the bend in this rod's enough. Like he'll just wear himself out in a second. I don't yeah. do anything stupid. He hasn't stopped lunging. He's just. I haven't got enough herd on him to. Here he comes. Not bad. He's just popped up. So look, he's got nothing left now. Fat, that's that's what it is. Yeah. We've got 30 bucks. Yeah. Come on, mate. Nice. I'll flick you off and get another one. In amongst it you do get some some nice chunky brim. But I, I you know like I, I'm quite happy to sit here all morning and catch these things.
Yeah. That's See. Where are we now? All right. I'm just going to go over your head here. It's about the end of the run. I don't know. Some some runs I can understand why they're there. Some this is one I don't like. They hold up to about here. We might have the school coming down with us, so we'll go a little bit longer. And if not, we'll go back over and we. Oh, I missed you already. Yeah, there's another one. This is not very big, this one. Yeah, you've woken up a bit, I think. Have a little legal, but... Here it is. It's only small. Half a yeah. Well, it's what's the twentieth of June, so. So the, do still get good, good breeze. Yeah, this is summertime fish still. But it's the ones in amongst it that there's some serious blue yeah, nose in them. Yeah. Well, this is it. This is why I wanted to come here because it's got all the pipes. Yeah. So I reckon it will rain, you know, and, and these fish know it. Yeah, so they, yeah. you, you got to get that down lower, get your strike lower. You've seen that then. I'll show you what I mean, like when I come out. I work it high, but when I go for the kill shot, I bring the rod down to about there. And then, and then sort of, yeah, it bounces off it and then up. up. But once you get that first inquiry, then you just got to really slow it down. If you don't get a strike on this one, though. I'd seriously think about going back up. Elbows. We must cut your elbows out. So that's why I sort of I sort of lock my elbows in here, yeah. from in into my body to stop me from doing that. So you got to sort of like it's a little game of tug of war to get that bite on. So I just lifted my elbow. Practice what you'll preach. Oh, yeah. right. Got him that time. Perfect. Yeah. Pretty shallow here. You might get you drive me out, out a bit wider. It's much. I was going to say it's a much nicer fish, but you honestly can't tell out here. No. no I'll get out of your way. You should be all right. It's just we're going into a bit of rocky stuff in the corner here. There he is. Oh, he's a nice little brim. Oh, that'll do. It's hard to. I want to go back and get that better sized fish, but we've still got enough of these to. Buddy. Yes, we're getting a few. So that's net damage from the old days. I, don't, I actually reckon he's probably a new fish into the system more than anything. You've been caught before, buddy. Are all squashed and squeezed. 
Ngawi. Yeah, I don't, don't know whether to go back up and have a bit of fun or roll through this section. I do get some nice fish here, but I just feel like they were much, they were bigger, fatter fish, those ones up further, like better, better size. But like, like we, it's hard to move when you keep catching fish. Although that, then it's easy to move when you see them that size, so. That's what flat fishing does to you. One of you just gets on a roll, and the other one, and it sort of stops the mojo with the other one. Yeah. And then all of a sudden you gotta just get that one fish, and then you, you get that roll going again. Exactly right. I picked up up there. It's that change of direction as we're hopping it when you turn it in. See, like that little change of direct, direction, and I'm on. That's a better one. Or is it? It's just another angry little wind of brim, I think. It's definitely that, that little, just, like when you settle your hop, just go left or right on the on the retrieve, and then straighten up again. There's some, it just seems to trigger these fish. This thing's going to wake up to be a half decent brim, I hope. Sounds like it. It's, it's acting like it, but I mean, it's hard to. Ah, uh, it's a flathead. Not even close. Well, we started with flathead and we ended with. I reckon we go back and do it run again. Because I, I, I honestly believe that's the start and the end of everything. Unless you want to go for a Jew. Yeah. You on? Mm, it's hard call. Depends on the size of this fish you bring up. It's giving you a bit of fight. Oh, what do you reckon? We'll just keep floating down here then. Oh, I know. Where's your camera? Where's your phone? to get a picture of these two in the water together. If you fucking stay still, <laughs> your flat is tied out and this little brim's still gone. Yep. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Come on, one more. Let's, let's just eat. Hey, they don't like you. Different species. Yeah. Well, get, a, get both up there, cuddling. Wait, 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 wait. There. Got it. Look at that. 